During my childhood, I saw lots of discrimination among people based on caste, creed and gender and also for being poor. The passion to help the people became stronger in myself. So in 2001, we, some of our friends who had like-mindedness, we started a charity and we started working among the urban poor. We had the vision that all the people must be given opportunity to realize their potentials. So we identified women from the community and we trained them to become preschool teachers, community health workers, also computer teachers. So they became the change agents. Through need analysis, we found out the community needed community-based preschools. So we started preschool and right now we have five preschool centers covering around 250 children every year. Baks are taro, baks are fish taro. Anta health pati anta chop taro, nel nela meeting pe taro. Viru achhi intla bag rain santa chop taro, ras taro ans parva le do. Health pati viru chop taro, egg tinala, vegetables tinala, chopless ko nedia la anta chop taro. Parva le school baks are fish taro. To reduce the school dropouts, we started tuitions. Also, we started supporting the children financially so that they will continue their studies. We give utmost importance to the health and we wanted to make the community people responsible to take care of their health. So we organize health awareness camps and health checkups for women and children so they become more responsible for their health. In 2006, we identified some women who missed their opportunity and we trained them in life coping skill and work skills and made them employable. It was surprising to see all of them got job at the end of the course. This is the starting of the community college and right now we have trained so far nearly 400 women and they are employed in different uh, sectors like BPO sector, in preschool, in uh, other schools also in retail. Why in this age you want to go now? You are around 38 years, you have got a 12 years daughter and a 3 years kid is there, you are going for studying now. I told for studying there is no age. Um, now actually after I got a job, I am working as teacher now. I am handling around 15 students. I am really very happy that I can do something in my life. Uh, simultaneously also some of the girls are continuing their studies and they are doing higher studies. This effort has made the girls become socially dignified and economically independent and they have a better standard of living. We feel very proud and we are very happy to bring change in the women's life. In future, for sustainable development, we also want to include men into this intervention. <laughs>